Good morning everybody. Welcome back to the channel. We're out here at my home club, Sandy Gallup, about to play a few holes and I thought, what better time to show you guys now what's in the bag. I got fitted for clubs, they've arrived. I've played a couple of rounds with them. Now it's time to show you guys. So we'll start out here on the 10th hole. It's a big long par five. So I get to show you my driver. I went with dun -dun -dun -dun, TSR2, Titleist driver. 10 degrees loft. I have the hazardous, oh, got a friend going across there this morning. Got the hazardous black counterbalance shaft. Sixty grams, but here it is. Beautiful looking club. Now, admittedly, I haven't gotten to use this club very much. It kind of scares me, but we'll have a go. Titleless TSR two, ten degrees loft. Hazardous counterbalance black 60 gram shaft. Low trajectory, low spin. Help with my aggressive swing. You see how it flies. Looks beautiful. Feels nice. See how she goes. Okay, not too bad of a tee shot. It's landed just here. I've got to go up around the corner, around to the right. I've got the TSR2 three wood. This is 15 degrees. Again, I've got the black hazardous shaft for my aggressive swing. So we'll give this a whack. So we'll give this a go. Up around the corner, to the right. Nothing too much. Now I'm not exactly sure, I might have got lucky, but I definitely hit the cart path. Just not sure if it bounced up around the corner or if it bounced into the muck. We'll go up together and we'll have a look. But honestly, how good did that sound? And it felt beautiful. All right, guys. What was a good three wood shot? Came up just short. I ended up going into the bush. Didn't make it around the corner. So I'm just gonna hit a, uh, probably, I got about 150, Got about 153 meters left, so it's probably a six iron, but I'm gonna hit a seven iron and just pull it up short and just at least get it off this hill. So I'll hit me seven iron. So here we go, just out into the open. Got it very chunky, but it's exactly what I wanted. So with my irons, I ended up getting fitted with the Titleist T300s. Very, very nice looking club. These clubs are four iron through to 48 degree. I got the AMT red shafts. AMT is ascending mass technology. So as the clubs get, let me think, as the clubs get shorter, they actually get heavier by three grams per club. They feel really nice. And I also got them extended by uh, almost an inch to fit my upright stance a bit more. So that's what I went with, the Titleist T300s. Very, very nice club. Still taking a bit of getting used to compared to the old Ben Hogan's that I was hitting. 
um, but I'm sure with time and practice, I'll get there in the end. So here we are, third shot on a par five. I've got 87 meters left to the flag. And the flag's just on the right hand side of the green. So inside of 120 meters, I've got wedges. The three wedges I got, well, I got the SM9 Vokies. I stuck with Titleist. All right, I got a 52 degree, a 56 degree, and a 60 degree. All in the brushed steel look. Very nice. Uh, I stuck with the standard wedge flex shafts on these. The reason I did that is because you're very, I'm very rarely swinging at full speed, fully aggressively with a wedge. So I stuck with the wedge flex. Didn't worry about the AMT shaft for my wedges. So on a shot like this, I should use the 52 degree, but I'm going uh, and, and hit it softly but I'm actually gonna hit the 56 and hit it relatively solid. Um, there's no wind out here this morning. So I'll take my new SM9, 56 degree, 56 degree, 12D bounce, 87 meters. Let's see what it can do. It was online. It was a really good shot. It just came up short. I should have hit the 52. I'll learn from next time. It is a par five. That... Okay, just a nice little chip up now. I've got my 60 degree SM9 Vokey in hand. Just get it up on the green, get it to stop. Magical. Magical. I couldn't ask for anything better than that. It's literally one foot from the hole. All right, this is a beautiful little par three. It's only 130 meters. Got an eight iron. This is the T300 eight iron. Very nice. I still don't think there is as good a looking club as the Stealth, which is what I really wanted. But it just goes to show that getting a fitting really makes a difference because my heart was set on the Stealth. Like I said, Bogey Golf, shout out, mate. Your clubs are great looking, but they didn't suit me as well as these Titleist T300s with an AMT shaft. So we'll hit this eight iron and see how we go. Got some kangaroos here have come to cheer me on. I'll give you a quick look if I can swivel the camera around. Look at this. Got one here. Got three here. Couple down here. The beauty of coming out this early on a beautiful summer's morning in Queensland, Australia. Don't be jealous. Don't be jealous. I'm sure uh, it gets lovely where you are as well. Here we go. Very nice. Just left hand side of the green. All right guys, so they're, they're my new clubs. Titleist T300, four through pitching wedge, Vokey wedges, SM9s, 52, 56 and 60 degree. All three have a different bounce on them for the different ground conditions and grass lengths. And then I'm using the TSR2 15 degree three wood and a 10 degree driver. I need something between my three wood and my four iron. I just haven't decided whether I want to go a hybrid club 
or a long iron. I tend to prefer irons. I'm a little bit old school, but again, depending on what I hit better. Um, so again, thanks guys. Thanks for, thanks for checking out the video. If you want to see me with these clubs in use, the other day at the start of the week, I went out and shot a video with Scott from Topped Golf. Go and check out his channel. Check out the video we did together there. Uh, I'll put the link in description. Sorry, I'm just checking these kangaroos. They're getting a bit toey. Feels like that. Yeah, so check out Topped Golf. Links in the description. Uh, you'll see me actually using these clubs for a round. And we played a scramble to see if two shit golfers can shoot a decent score over nine holes. Uh, let us know what you think. All right, guys. Thanks very much. Enjoy your day. I hope you get out for a round of golf.